welcome this is the energy vibration reading for um the birthday people okay it is the birthday people so this week is the second week of the year 2019 and week begins from the 7th until the 13th so I want to say to each and every person thank you for being here thank you for being back thank you for the wonderful like shares and support um, this is the beginning of a new year okay the month is the month of uh, um, water in the energy in this week is the energy of a fire energy it is the energy of the devil now whenever this energy comes up is that there is going to be the energy vibration of a lot of ego based people very ego based people people who people um, in situations that is coming up very ego um, eccentric ego and uh, um, a lot of lies and deception so expect this week to be a week of um, um, and the month this month um, for a lot of you who are born the 7th of January until the 13th of January that is going to be very very this year it's going to be a lot of egos a lot of egos for you guys who were born from the 7th on the 13th okay zodiac energy is a hurt so that is good so um, you're still vibrating and the zodiac energy of your own birthdays so this is wonderful and this is good so let's see what this week uh, this new year is going to be starting for you guys who were born and um, happy birthdays I've got to do so many readings for you birthday people which is just so fantastic so wonderful so good thank you for connecting with me so this year is bringing you in a very very much fire year it's a year of fire for you guys whatever the situation is it's just really a year of fire that is going on for you guys and what we're going to be doing is that we're going to be looking on um, two extra energies um, to see what is going to be affecting you so each and every one of you will receive two extra energy and then I'm going to do um, a bonus um, a reading for you guys because um, we're changing up the energies okay so for the people who were born um, 12 and 13th of January you're going to be dealing with the year and a very victorious outcome so if your birthday um, is on um, the 8th and uh, <coughs> sorry 8th of January very very wonderful so let's see <coughs> sorry what is happening completion <coughs> oh, wonderful situation it's coming up for you guys new start especially with work it's going to be coming up which is going to be very good okay very good I haven't drank anything um the expression for you um, ladies some of you young ladies is going to be walking away from a situation in this year so ladies between the ages of um, ladies between the ages of uh, um, uh, say 18 to um, 45 you're going to be walking away from a lot of stuff this year you're going to be just taking your reign walking away from a lot of stuff in this year a lot of stuff that has been affecting you you're going to be deciding to walk away from a lot of stuff that is affecting you you're going to be turning your back you're going to be um, deciding it's time for me to leave the situation and it's going to be good okay so whatever the situation is in your life some of you ladies between the ages of 18 and 45 it's going to be just walking away from things and build on your financial stability and this is going to be good you're going to be finding the inner strength to um, build basically on your financial stability and the end of the situation and a positive new beginning is going to be coming in for a lot of you people so let's check out what is happening for you Capricorns Capricorns we are having birthday Capricorns who are having birthdays, Capis, Capis, Capis who are having birthdays from the 
the 7th of January until the 13th. Let's see what's happening for the campus. Uh, we are going to give um, each and every person wonderful, wonderful. Each and every person um, receive three extras. Each and every person receive three extras okay which is going to be good so you're going to be knowing what to the um to look for okay some blockage bam, bam. end of the power struggle that is going to be happening and of power struggles that is going to be happening and the last three that we have so let's see what is going to be coming up. Okay, okay, okay. A lot of psychic energies, a lot of ending of emotional situations. You're going to be just deciding to walk away from situation, ending situations, and it's going to be positive. Okay, so we're looking at the people who were born on the 7th. If you were born on the 7th of January, you're dealing with a situation that has to do with... um the Prince of Cups and uh, um, you're completing a situation so now with the energy of the Prince of Cups and you're completing a situation there's gonna be a judgment call a judgment call this judgment call could affect uh, if you have a child that is a Pisces cancer or a scorpion it could affect this child okay whatever the situation is this judgment call could affect this child this situation is going to be ending in this year 2019 you're going to decide i have come to a decision that whatever the situation is i'm going to be ending this okay um there is completion to a situation that you have to do with a child is it a pisces a cancer or a scorpion you're going to decide to end the situation move away from the situation or let this child be so that he can find himself home okay there's going to be information that is going to be coming out about this child, whatever the situation is. Um, the situation that is about to come up for this child in this year, it's going to be significant, okay? Because a lot of information is going to be coming out. Because um, this child can be a, um, um, a woman or a man, but whatever the situation is with this person, um, you are having this judgment call with this person, okay? So... Um, information breakthroughs are going to be coming out and um, it's all about uh, information and breakthroughs are definitely going to be coming out now the extra bonus what you guys have is that, that you're going to be financial stable uh, money is going to be coming in to you and some of you are going to be meeting your twin flame or soulmate so it's a wonderful year um, new information but also extra money is going to be coming in there's an offer that is coming in and this offer is coming in from a past love this person is really someone who um love you were without end some of you are going to be meeting your twin flame and your soul flame so if you were born on the 7th of january expect to have a wonderful year because you're closing off um you're closing off something with a child or a young person um, it could be um, your partner your ex-partner you're closing you're, you're ending something in your life so this is going to be good now as we look at the people who were born on the 8th this is going to be a good year for you um, it's going to be the ending of something but new positive things it's like your financial stability is going to be in alignment um, you're going to be raising the bar in your life you're going to be learning to understand that sometimes things have to end in your life so that you can move forward and this is going to be very very good and very very promising because um, what is transpiring is that uh, you're going to be healing your emotions okay the energy of the moon is emotion but the, en the energy of the moon is also bringing an end to um, negative people and situations in your life and leaving that behind you and moving forward on a very positive note um, 
you are deciding that I understand what it's all about and I've seen what it's all about I don't want to be a part of it and I am um, sending my grounds to the people who have been blocking my life and these negative forces and energies and I'm deciding to make a new start in my life this year so it could be a um, new start um, where you're deciding to move houses um, you're really deciding that life has come to an end for a certain situation you're going to be very successful at this um, success is going to come in especially um, for people who are looking to buy and uh, buy houses um, buying houses but also um, selling houses um, this is going to be a good year do it in the beginning of this year because that is going to be affecting you some of you men are going to be um, very successful with a situation that has to do with a house if you are um, uh, a realtor of that sort of a thing um, this is going to be happening for you it's going to be very very positive okay so if you um, are in a, a buying and selling house it's going to be good um, this is a message for some people also to become a realtor because you will be very good in this and it's going to be very very positive okay so whatever the situation is uh, it's going to be good now the storm the star comes up and your wishes and dreams are going to be coming true some of you are going to be having very good repetition um, and some of you are going to decide to buy new houses okay for the people in real estate it's going to be extremely extremely good so um, for the men um, men are going to be very successful and uh, men are going to be very successful but also very famous okay so this is going to be a good year for you guys the energy of family some of you um, and that's what I said <laughs> long lord and family I said it real estate um, if you're in real estate it's going to be extremely extremely good for you guys in this year so um, that is wonderful and positive so we're moving on to the people um, we're moving on to the people who were born on the 9th of January if you were born on the 9th of January you have the energy of the fool now the energy of the fool is a very very positive energy this is the energy of new prosperity and new beginning so in um, business some of you could be starting your own business and this is going to be good by balancing out your energy vibration it's going to be so positive um, um, if you're a business person some of you could be getting higher promotions very positive high promotional jobs is going to be coming in for you um, if you're studying and finish a study you're going to be extremely good um, and this energy of you starting a new or going on a new journey some of you are going to be traveling relocation could be in your cards also so this is going to be good your extra bonus that is coming out is is the energy of news is coming of uh, something that has been deceptive news is coming of some deception that has taken place so you're going to be finding out um, some news about something deception that has taken place okay and I hate when the Fox comes up because the Fox is I uh, is actually um, it could be that some something was stolen from you okay so you could be receiving the Fox's deception okay some really deceptive news is on its way to you um, documents uh, mail packages something was stolen from you okay um and something was um stolen from you some some um some information or some documentation that you were supposed to re receive was stolen from you okay the energy of the fox is always uh, um and some of you could be receiving a job offer some of you could be receiving a letter from work and some of you are going to be receiving some untrustworthy news some uh, deception and untrustworthy news so be aware of that in the year 2019 for the people who were born on the 9th of January let's look at the people who were born on the 10th of January um, yeah um, 7 8 9 10 10th of January you have the energy of 
um, achievement. This is a year where you're going to be standing up and standing up really to um, certain situations that has been happening in your life. You're going to be really standing up to certain situation that has been happening in your life. You're going to be building your life. Some of you are going to be standing up against a deceptive organization or someone that is an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius. Very deceptive, very deceptive. Information is going to be coming at you. Some very deceptive situation with an ex boss or someone in power or that sort of a thing but some very 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 unusual deceptive situation that is going to be coming at you so you have to be aware about the situation that has transpired okay so some of you are going to be dealing with people in power and you're trying to resolve a situation and this is very deceptive because I'm seeing the energy of um, it's as if they want to put up some blocks for you but this is not going to be happening because you're going to be standing your ground and said hell no it's not happening because um, you know so whoever you're dealing with um, it could be your boss it could be people in power you're going to be a hell no no um, you're going to be standing um, your ground and said no I'm not accepting this there should be some resolution between you and a partner or some contract but here is a block now whatever this block is I'm gonna take a look to see what what is this block and who is making this block because some resolution should have been coming up for you but someone wants to put a block on it and you um, are going to be just standing up and said hell no no you don't have no reign over my life and you're just gonna be standing up and said hell no okay so let's see what is this block who is blocking this what is this block and who is blocking this okay just this so you're going to be winning and you're going to be resolving this you're definitely going to be winning and definitely going to be resolving this okay you are definitely going to win it so the outcomes of the extra you had the energy of the block and the person that was blocking you is an Aries uh, is an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius the person that was blocking you is an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius there is the person okay um oh, this is a lady 40 45 years and older is it Aries Leo or Sagittarius she was the person that was blocking you but this block is going to be lifted um and you are going to be coming out on top okay this block is going to be lifted energy of the Sun and you're going to be coming out on top whatever the situation is and whatever that was transpiring so you know in life and this is what I always say to people be careful in life because you have some really nasty people um, to deal with in life because whoever that lady was was lying and being very deceptive so for the people who were born on the tent it's it's it's, it's going to be a year where you're dealing with people in powers and they have been lying and deceiving and making decision that from out of lies and deception and now the Sun now the truth about this person is going to be coming out two people um, the mother or the child so some of you could be dealing with a divorcee with the mother and the child that has been lying and deceiving and justice comes out justice comes out and bring down the queen of swords justice comes down and bring down the queen of swords so whoever the queen of swords is that has made up and lie and deceivingly done something against you you're going to be winning because the energy of the sun and justice and the sun over these people is going to be good okay so let's look at the people who were born on the 11th of January it's going to be a very powerful year for you guys because what is just what is happening and what is transpiring this is going to be such a powerful year for you especially if you're in relationship with a Pisces Pisces cancer or a scorpion um, some of you are going to be having some heartbreaks some of you might be having some heartbreaks if you're in relationship with a Pisces cancer or a scorpion okay um, the um, the blocks and the power struggle is going to be over definitely the blocks and power struggles are going to be hopeful but you're definitely going to be having this art break with this person for whatever the reason is now there was some blocks uh, and this was caused by someone in power but this is going to be released okay 
um, for the rest it's going to be a powerful year where a lot of people are connecting with their twin flame and their soulmate mate and this is going to be um, very wonderful very extremely wonderful because what is transpiring what is happening despite of the heartbreak so um, and the blocks that was there door people of uh, um, power or people try to reign their power it's coming to an end okay so through the block and the struggle of heartbreaks that was there and the people who were in power they are going to try to stop and reign their power and this is going to be good so um, it's you know it's 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 very very positive it's it is a situation where um, there was so much lies and deceptfulness some some of you who are in relationship with um, a Pisces cancer or a scorpion be aware because um, some situation information might come comes out and the information and situation that is going to be coming out about this person is basically that um, some lies some lies and deception that you weren't aware of okay so okay let's look because we need to know what is this heartbreak for the people who are born on the 11th why is this heartbreak so only people who were in relationship with a Pisces cancer or a scorpion might have some heartbreak the rest of you are going to be good okay the lovers uh, comes up again um, tired and um, the Queen of Cups so some of you could be realizing that this person um, and that is for the people who are born on the 11th that um, this person because definitely a lot of you who were born on the 11th is going to be connecting with your twin flame and your soulmate a lot of people that was born on the 11th is going to be connecting with the twin flame and the soul mate okay and some of you are going to just take a break some of you have some regrets in a relationship but some of you are going to be connecting with your twin flame and your soul mate now we're looking at the people who are born on the 12th of January it's going to be a beautiful year it's going to be a year of you moving moving forward um, business project and that sort of a thing is going to be very positive especially the men um, your project and your business is going to be um, so positive people who are in business is going to be very very positive people who are um, climbing the ladder this is going to be a good year for you whoever is out there climbing the ladder whoever is out there that has been um working through negative energies and negative situation it's going to be working and climbing the ladder and this is going to be good okay so you men um a wonderful year wonderful positive year for the people also who have business your business is going to be taken off it's going to be very positive um you're going to be moving up up moving moving upwards okay the extra message that is here is that some of you um, are going to be finding out a secret and you're going to be making a decision to end something so some of you are going to be finding out a secret and you're going to be deciding to end something so whatever that was playing whatever that was there you're going to be finding some secrets out and you're going to decide to end something so this is good um, breakthroughs information so secrets is going to be coming out for some of you it's breakthrough for some of you it's secrets but whatever it is there is going to be a duality because um, a lot of opportunities is going to be opening up some of you are going to be realizing um, multiple you reached a crossroad some of you are going to be definitely reaching a crossroad and with you reaching this crossroad you're going to discover something something is um it's going to be discovered and uh, that is going to bring an end um to a situation okay so some of you um have reached a crossroad and uh, um and um whatever that was what was hidden whatever that was hidden because you coming to this crossroad is uh, showing you multiple opportunities and multiple ways of moving forward and what is going to be transpiring is that some secret information some secret knowledge is going to come out some of you could be writing a book this year and if you get the urge of writing a book write the book because it's going to be very very good okay um, some of you some secrets is a burden but you're going to be releasing the secret fake knowledge a lot of you have um, information about um, a lot of you have some information about um, things 
um, and this information is going to be coming up you're going to be victorious and successful in your endeavor so that is um, very very wonderful okay as we move forward we have the energy of strength for the people who are born on the 13th and um, what is transpiring is that um, you need to find inner strength and you um, in this year is going to be a year of uh, are really going through because you're dealing with the energy of the devil so for the people who are born on the 13th you're dealing with the energy of the devil and it's finding in a strength to deal with a situation and to move forward you're turning your back on a situation and you're going to decide that I'm ending certain negative situation that has been transpiring for me okay when you're ending certain negative situation that has been transpiring it's going to be um, okay it's going to be okay all right it's going to be okay some of you are going to be having situation with your kids um, it could be some sickness um, um, that you're going to be dealing with your kids if you have kids it could be you but it's it's going to be over the sickness was not didn't come natural it was natural sickness is um, a sickness that was bring on by people of lower negative energies okay and this is going to come to an end see um, the lies and the deception is going to be coming to an end for some of you who does, doesn't have kids um, um, and, and and was going to some really nasty um, nasty deceptive things this is um, finally going to come to an end um, some of you um, might um, be attacked by a woman so be aware of this but um, this saying that um, is a slice is definitely an out okay so be careful that some of you might be attacked by a woman so you need to be careful about this some of you might be attacked by a woman it can be via negative energies or it can be just um, that this person is just a nasty person she lost she has lost and um, behaving very very nasty so what a year for you guys what a year having the energy of the devil in a year is is not really you have to strong, find the inner strength okay you have to find the inner strength but I'm seeing that a lot of you who were born on the 11th negative things negative situation that was affecting you is just going to be coming to an end and this is going to be good okay so uh, you guys have number 21 and number 21 is in this year also so isn't this beautiful your home part so it's a year of you guys finding your own part this is going to be good this is going to be positive it's a year of you guys finding your own part moving forward in a positive note and this is going to be positive okay the affirmation is that I follow my own unique part with courage and strength I follow my own unique part with courage and strength okay so very 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 positive I want to say to each and every person thank you for being here thank you for being back um, and like share these videos namaste until next time